Hello YouTube fam, it's Cup of Katie here and today I have a Stitch Fix unboxing for you, yay! I have a very exciting box. There are some really cute summer pieces in here as well as some fall things. I love fall, it is my most favorite season. I love the chunky turtlenecks, the cozy sweaters, the distressed denim, the blanket scarves, you name it. Everything about the fall fashion, I love it. So I'm excited to try on those pieces for you you so I will have linked in the description box $25 off if you are new to Stitch Fix you can take that $25 and apply to any of the five items that they will send you so it's very much designed towards the look or items that you may be needing if you need more jeans or if you need a pair of shoes or if you need a dress for a certain occasion you let them your stylist know and they can um, find items for you so um, that $25 will come off um, one item and it's totally worth trying out so I will have that link in the description box for you to save that money. So make sure you are subscribed to catch me in future videos. I do many unboxings as well as some decorating videos. I just did a fall um, decorate with me and you definitely should check it out. I'll have it in the description box as well. So um, make sure that you grab your cup of coffee or tea and let's get to trying the items on. <laughs> about the details now now this is my 20th fix so the stylists have more than enough idea of items and styles that I like and generally generally pick and purchase from so um, this box was pretty much a hit I loved every item in my box however this box is priced more than usual pieces I get in my boxes so um, with that being said there are some um, higher brand um in this one because typically i get items from like mason and bell um fortune and ivy and brands like that where they're a little lower but i have some pieces here that you'll see what i'm talking about so the first piece is at arty style so i've received one other item before and they were priced higher too so this is the arty style tamari shaker stitch hoodie pullover and they called it in the color blue in a large so Looking at this online, um, I thought this was gray. So it's like a weird kind of like, not cobalt blue, but I don't know how to describe it. But it's made of a really nice material. It's on the thicker side, so it's definitely get, it gives you that cozy vibe that I absolutely love. I wasn't 100% sure about the hood because I wouldn't typically wear this with the hood up or anything like that but um it definitely does give it that little cozy vibe so um there isn't any you know like how some of the sleeves will have that like little thumb hole there isn't any on there however i felt like this one needed it because it just kind of gives you that little extra i don't know like flair to it that i always love on tops but um yeah this top is made very very well i wish you could feel it um it is priced at 68 dollars. i don't know if i said that or not but um i typically don't spend around 70 dollars on a sweater so 
And like I said, I when I initially first saw it, I was like, Ugh, I don't wear this color blue. Like I don't own anything this color, which would be a good thing then, you know, because like I like buying things which I don't have lots of colors of. But I could see myself wearing this more if this was gray or if it was even cream or even like an olive green or like a burnt orange would be really pretty. I just don't see myself gravitating towards this um, with this color so probably will be sending this item back so the next item I received is the cotton emporium um, they called it the Valerie textured color black um, cardigan in beige and a large for $48 so this cardigan looks very much like a cardigan I already own so Hold on one second, I'm gonna go grab it so you can see what I'm talking about. So this is the cardigan I think it looks similar to. It's like in the same color, kind of like, you know, taupey brown. And then um, I have, um, you know, that little striping of like a cream in it. And this one only has the bottom, but this one has gray on the bottom. And I like that this one is long. So this is why I purchased this one when I received this in a previous fix. But th this item that I received in this box reminds me very much of this one and like, I don't know I just don't like getting like duplicate items like that so I don't know I just can't see myself wearing it since I already have something like it and I honestly own two other cardigans in like a beige color so to have a fourth just kind of doesn't make sense so um, it's very cute it's something I typically would have purchased if I didn't have one like it but um, probably will send this one back um on the other hand let me just finish um it's made really nice I love the pocket detail and it's just at the length where it kind of covers your butt so I'm about five foot six and um I think it covers at a very nice length so it is a very cute cardigan so if you need one this is a great one to request again I always link everything in the description box the descriptions of each of these items in case if you loved any of the pieces and you wanted to let your stylist know which ones um you liked so the next item I received was the cut from the cloth Curtis high-waisted scissor um, distressed um, shorts in black um, and they are priced at $68 so I don't like spending $68 on shorts um, it's different when it's jeans because I wear jeans way much more than I wear shorts um, our summers are very short here in Wisconsin but um, I have told my stylist that I've been looking for black um, shorts and so I think that's why they sent them um, it's not in the inseam that I like I think these are like a three inch inseam and I typically like a five inch just so that's just not riding you in those weird areas so um, the cut from the cloth um, jeans shorts any any bottoms that you receive from them are very comfortable they're stretchy they fit you nice and um, I really like the way they fit but I just don't like that price point so um, I will be sending those back and to touch base again on that card again um, I told my stylist I was looking for either a like white or beige kind of colored or a black cardigan so that's why she sent me that one I think so um, very close but not all the way with some of the items that they're sending me so the fourth item that they sent me is um, a Daniel Rain hence the more expensive items um, they called this the Wacy um, lace crocheted detailed knit tank in beige and a large for $58 again very expensive for a tank top um, it's very pretty I love the floral details as you can tell I'm a sucker for floral detailed tank tops um, it's got a really pretty like right here along the like neckline right on both sides and then even on the back it's got that really pretty detailing too which Oh, I'm always a sucker for a very pretty like tank top because I think they're great just to wear alone or to layer them with cardigans but again this price point I just can't justify the money for it like if these were $40 I think I'd be I know that's even still crazy to say $40 for a tank top but like I'd gravitate towards towards it more than the price that it is so I will be sending this back, unfortunately. Um, yeah, it's very pretty. I've never received any Daniel Rain items in my boxes. If any of you have received them, how do they hold up? Do you love them? Um, do you wear them a lot? Um, I do know that I reach for a lot of my stitch fix pieces so that's one reason why I love getting the boxes because they're clothing it's clothing that I wear a lot and I think it's good use like one of my tank tops that I felt like I splurged on probably a year and a half ago 
I wear all the time and it's held up beautifully so I that's what I love about the items like they don't like wear really like quickly so um, I think they last really well so I'm saving the best for last so the last piece is another Daniel Rain tank top this is the Daniel Rain Quinn Keyhole Crochet top in off-white in a large for $64 Ugh, why can't this one be cheaper um, I think this tank top is beautiful um, it's got this really pretty crocheted um, pattern right at the neckline with this like cute kind of like keyhole kind of opening um, on the back side it buttons um, right here at the top as well as it kind of like has that same mimicking keyhole on the back and that lace detailing runs all the way to the bottom and the bottom slits like that I think that is so pretty I don't own any tank tops like that I think it's a pretty color choice I'm um, even with it just being beige or um, you know it's great because then it's neutral it can go with a lot it doesn't have some crazy funky pa funky pattern on it um, yeah I just think it's a very very pretty piece um, I've seen this pop up in my like shop area and I've always contemplated getting it um, I've seen it um, in other colors I believe they have it in black and I can't remember the other colors that they have but I'm really excited they sent me this piece because I think it's really pretty so <sighs> if I were to keep anything out of the box it would be this tank top but I can't see myself spending $64 on a tank top why must this brand be so expensive Ugh. All right, ladies, let's go over the details. So um, the whole box, if I were to get everything, um, comes to 306 And then with the buy all discount, 25% off, they take $76.50 off, which brings my box to $229.50. It's an expensive box. Um, usually, most of my boxes that I share range from like the 140 to 170 on the high end range, um, and this doesn't even include jeans. Um, it's a pair of shorts, and all the rest were um, what they send. I'm trying to think, two tanks, shorts, cardigan, and the sweater. So I don't know. Um, it's very um, on the high end. I'm not super in the market for any of these pieces um it's not like i was like oh my god i i need one of these things because whatever do we ever really need clothing we always need clothing <laughs> um but um yeah i'm probably not gonna keep any of it unfortunately do you guys ever have that happen where you get the box and maybe the price points weren't right for you or the fits weren't good or you just weren't in love with it and then you send everything back I know I hate doing that, um, but the good thing is is that I bought the Style Pass um, probably almost like eight months ago. Um, look out for that when it does come out. You pay for the um, styling fee up front and then you get it like waived for the year. So um, I won't be eating up that like 20, 20 or $25 styling fee because I have already you know paid for it in, in advance and got my use out of it so um but yeah i just um wanted to share these beautiful pieces with you let me know if you've gotten any of these pieces which pieces were your favorite and what pieces you're looking forward to in um some of your fix boxes so make sure that you again um give this video a big thumbs up if you like these type of videos and i can't wait to catch you in another video bye